welcome guys to another review this time of a rom and this is xnote 5.0 transformer rom that i want to review and wow what a rom it's it's a beautiful rom and i'm gonna show you some things you can do with this rom uh, this is my ui for now i like to change change it <laughs> almost every day but for now it looks like this and as you can see i don't have uh, any icons like uh, google play store and samsung app store and i use lmt launcher for for reaching all of those uh, for 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 reach uh, Google Play Store and etc. An example if you got the long press here, I got all of the other things that I use like S Note and Antec Explorer, the X Note control and my contacts and telephone. So yeah, it's super nice. And uh, let's see here, I'm gonna show you some more cool things. Uh, we got the X Transformer, so you can run uh, your ROM in different DPIs. Uh, at the moment, I'm running at 420 DPI, and it's beautiful, it's working perfectly. I have no errors whatsoever. And I haven't tried 480 DPI, but I think 420 is just perfect for me. So it's no no need to go for 480 for me. So yeah, the current DPI is 420. And it's working perfectly. I love this ROM. It's... Uh, in my opinion the best rom out there right now and also i bought the floating notifications because i love love it for example i play a lot of games on my telephone and when i get a email or message or anything else the, uh, this floating notification will pop up so it's it's a beautiful app and you can add anything uh, any app you want to to your floating notification and you can do many many uh, different uh, mod, um, mods for your uh, floating notification like make it bigger and yeah things things like that and to be honest now it's a little bit small so we can change it to let's say 200 and see how it looks like hmm that that looks a little bit more better so yeah and let's see here what do we got more yeah so when you install this rom uh, you got you can choose uh, to have 4.4 kitkat mode and you can choose to have uh, the samsung uh, mode and i choose i did choose uh, the 4.4 kitkat mode because you can uh, come back to touch with if you want so I'm gonna show you the 4.4 uh, KitKat mode uh, you see this one start program and I press it once and go so there you go guys I haven't been here too much yet but I'm gonna take away these. So this is the 4.4 KitKat mode, and wow, it's it looks beautiful. 
I haven't I want to take away this Google uh, thing here but I don't know how to do it so I have to spend some more time in this mode that is 4.4 KitKat mode but as you can see it's working perfectly no errors no nothing and you got the 4.4 play store I think it is it's the inverted one I got it on my uh, on my other one too on my Samsung touch with one and as you know now you don't have uh, messages but you have hangouts and through hangouts you can reach your contacts you can send messages you can yeah you can do everything you can do video calls and you can do everything you want so yeah it's pretty cool if i could tell you tell you it like that yes it's super nice but i kind of like touch with in 420 dpi and it working so perfectly and i love the lmt launcher as you can see it's working so good everything is perfect and by the way before i go any further i want to say thank you to galaxy man for his beautiful theme uh, i have seen in the xda forums about people asking if you can flash galaxy man's uh, theme with tvrp and yes you can as you can see here i use i i do use his theme as you can see the wi-fi icon is uh, uh, themed and the G uh, GPS and the vibrator the screen rotation the Bluetooth you can see here I only want to show you guys and as you can see everything is themed and this is from Galaxy Man it's version 0 0.88 if I do remember correctly uh, now I have disabled many things here, but yeah, you can see the NFC and everything is beautifully themed by Galaxy Man. So, and it works perfectly with uh, when I'm exposed to, so it's super nice. So to anyone who wants to know if you can flash this uh, theme with TVRP, yes you can. You can flash it without any worries. And I'm running Xnote 5.0 Transformer Edition and I did choose the 4.4 KitKat mode. And you get both mode. Uh, the touch with mode and uh, 4.4 KitKat mode so yeah this ROM is beautiful and the battery life is super nice and as you can see it's uh, lagging a little bit now it's because of the recorder it's nothing I can do about it but when as the same second as I stop the recorder it's floating like oh it's flying like a bird it's so nice and just now i did flash this this one this is the inverted play store i did download from the over the air updates as you can see everything is black it's pretty nice because the white color is pretty harsh uh, for your eyes so yeah this is the xnote 5.0 transformer edition and i want to say thank you for the devs for doing such a beautiful rom and i want to say thank you for uh,
Galaxy Man's beautiful theme as you can see here everything is themed the background and every single icon is themed and it's so beautifully themed I I just love it it's perfect so yeah this ROM is great that's all I have to say about this ROM and I have been running this ROM now for one week I think and the battery life is superb and instead of showing you uh, benchmarks and batteries and uh, how this and that is better if for you to try the ROM by yourself set it up as you like and you set set up your LMT launcher and everything and then you try try it out for one week and after you make up your mind I heard many people telling me Bobcat ROM is the best ROM and I have to say Bobcat ROM and Xnode is my two favorite ROMs those are the ROMs that I jump from from Xnode to Bobcat from Bobcat to Xnode <laughs> so yeah and you can see here messages too everything is themed as you can see everything is beautifully themed So yeah, and you see how much you can save on your screen in 420 dpi and also uh, with your LMT launcher you can save so much space, it's incredible. So yeah guys, I want to say thank you for watching. This was Xnote 5.0 Transformer Edition with 4.4 KitKat and TouchWiz 2. If you choose 4.4 KitKat mode, you can have your TouchWiz 2 as you can see here. You just press your menu button and you can choose which one you want to use. And I will go with TouchWiz for now until I have more time to explore uh, the 4.4 KitKat mode so yeah this is all guys I hope you did enjoy uh, the ROM review and the next uh, review will be a game so I hope you guys stay tuned and See you in a while guys, take care and thank you for watching the video and bye bye.